I'm Dragos and in this video we're going to take a look at Flux AI. If you don't know Flux AI, it's a text to image generator that can help you create images and lately it has received a lot of chatter because it's supposed to be better than Midjourney and Delhi 3. So in this video we're going to check it out and see how we can use it for free even. So this is their website and in here you see that this model is built by blackforestlabs.ai and this is their website and in here you see some images that are generated with uh, flux and you see that they are super realistic and uh, are offering a very good quality you see that most of them are looking very nice and right now they have like uh, three models flux.1 is the model and it's with pro the first one then the one that you can use it for free it's the dev one which offers similar things with the pro one and the other one that uh, it is uh, more light is the channel one and um, this can be used in uh, replicate and in uh, file.ai so in here we're gonna see the details and uh, the dev one can be used for free with hugging face and for instance if you're going to check the free one you see in here that you will have an interface where you can tell it what to create most of the times it's working it takes a couple of seconds to generate the image for you but you can try it for free and see how it's using so in here you see for instance that i asked him to uh, create a cat on a skateboard with the flux ai in the right uh, it did uh, like a decent job created something nice also the text is not quite good we're going to see the modified version on how it's working and if you want to run the pro or dev one and pay per uh, image base you have the options to do that with file.ai and in here you see that for instance you can uh, have uh, like an image this one is the pro one so you can have about uh, five cents per image so it's quite cheap so for uh, one dollar you can have 20 images and in here you have the options to choose the details also you have the options to run the dev one which is cheaper and uh, this one if we're going to check it uh, cost half of the pro one we have the options to have 40 images and in here we have also some examples that you can check with the prompts so you see in here that you can also see what others have uh, created and you have the uh, infrared steps and the guided scale and uh, yeah you can copy the prompt and try it yourself and uh, this is only on the flux the other options to run this it's also on this website with replicate again in here you will again run per uh, per use basis so Every time when you want to create an image, it will just uh, charge you, so you don't need to pay upfront. So these are the premium options that can be used to run this Flux. And uh, right now we can uh, go and check the Hugging Face one. And in here you see that you have the Flux.1 dash dev that uh, can be used in the in the hugging face and in here you have some spaces like this you can access it so you click spaces and in here you search for flux.1 so you can also do it like this flux.1 right now you will see all the flux um, spaces that are created and you can choose one uh, from from here so you have this black forest labs created by them and mercury there is another one let's go with this one and if you are going to check this one in here you will see that you can enter your prompt and in here the image will be generated and in here you will have the options to choose the seed and the other things and for instance let's create a youtube thumbnail and see how this is doing i will choose the photo format in here like this and let me go and show you the prompt so basically in here it will be the prompt create a dynamic youtube thumbnail featuring a cool um, anthropic cat skateboarding through a non lit times and so on i will add the prompt into the description so you can check it so yeah this one it's built on top of the, of the previous one it's done with 
Claude and I have to ask him to create a more engaging one. In the past, I have created this one and uh, yeah, it wasn't too detailed. So I wanted to try something that is more detailed. So I put the prompt in here. Let's see what it's doing. I will hit run. And right now, this will wait for a GPU to become available. And then it will generate an image. It can have an error in the beginning. It depends on the load that it is on the hugging face. And right now you see that they successfully acquired the GPU. And this would take about, I don't know, uh, 40 seconds to 60 seconds to finish. And in the end we should have the, the image. And uh, let's wait for this to, to finish. Okay, so right now we see that the image has been uh, generated and you see that right now this is looking uh, more nice because the prompt it's better than the one that I've created myself. The cloud one, it's more detailed and it created a nice image. So you can download this image like uh, Flux.ai and save it. This is Flux.ai and uh, in here you can uh, try it for, for free and you can see if it does a better job than the DL3 or the Mid Journey one. I hope you enjoyed the video. In case you did, please don't forget to like and subscribe.